What's going on guys? I am here on Thronecraft. I am here at Average Drifter's base or better known as Bambi. He is John in this game and this is his base. We're gonna check it out. This is just a little room right here with a bed. It's like a little living room slash bedroom, it's couch, fire, storage room, stores all the stuff, cooks his food and stuff. I don't know what this room's for, but that is basically his base. There's one more little area we can go check out right now, which is up here. You have to pay taxes in Throne Craft. So he has a taxes box and a mailbox. And then right up here is just a little conference, conference room, or whatever you want to call it. It has a little table, has chairs. You can actually sit in them. Yeah, you can sit in them. And now we are going to head over to my base. He has a farm, which looks like his seeds turned into dead bushes. Let's head over to my house. So, I tried to record a video earlier of me building my house, but it kind of, the file got corrupted and all that, and I couldn't recover it. So now, you're just going to have to deal with me not being able to show you the progress of my base as I built it. So I have a little farm as you can see I got a dead bush now, I gotta replant it. And then this is just a really dead bush that you can't get a seed back from. I have a horse. So this is my base so far. I may add some stuff to the outside to the windows up there. As you can see it's nice and neat over here. But for some reason, it seems to be glitched. There's supposed to be these on every side. So I may have to fix that in a little bit. But what I'm going to be doing in this video, either this video or next video, I'm going to be going, me and... Bambi are going to be going to the military outpost to see if we can get into the guard or military to protect either the king, princess, or anything to protect Stonovan, which is where we live. And now, I don't know what to do right now, but I may go see anybody around here. There's only a little bit of people on right now because it's pretty late at night, but... I may just like go dig for a little bit and just go do random stuff because I got my house done which took a really long time because nobody had the materials I needed it, like wool is really hard to come by wool glass all that you have to buy it from people so this is my storage chest my storage rooms down here just got random stuff got some armor and then up here, which is the main floor, has a little kitchen, not really kitchen, but just a little area where you can eat and stuff like that. Then we go up a layer, you have my bedroom with three beds, I couldn't use one, because then it would be just weird, I can't stand one, I usually use two, but I can't put two because then I would have one missing in the middle, now I just have three. I have a little chest on the side, two chests, one for if I ever get a wife or something, I don't know. But there is a crafting table, you go up a floor, there's just a little bit of paintings, dragon, some kind of artifact, evil king, and a castle. And we go out here, and then this is my balcony where you can just see a little bit over there. There's a Swedish person, um, there's somebody's little uh, 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 gate, I don't know what to call it. Um, there's their house. So now we can go explore the kingdom, our kingdom, which is Stonovin. So we are at the hill district of Stonovin. We just got put up here because we were close to it and because this is the, like the only place where there are plots left. As you can see, there's just people building everywhere. That's like a Lord Spooter. There's John's house or Bambi's 
or average drifters and I don't know whose house these are they're just a bunch of random people that are in our town somebody has a little cage where they keep their animals this guy I met earlier he gave me the glass for my house so shout out to him he I'm pretty sure this is his house I'm pretty sure Oh yeah, I met him earlier when he was building his house. Yeah. But then he was destroying this little house because somebody built the house here, or he built the house there, and he didn't like it, so he destroyed it and then built this. It's still in progress. And then there's this house. Or not house, but little um, horse cave, horse barn. And then as we come down, you can see a little piggy there. It's a pretty nice map. There's a horse, lots of stuff, chicken, cow, rabbit. As we keep going down, you'll see more houses, because we're in the um, home district or house district. And then this is the military guy's house. The military or guard's house. This is um, Catherine's and Charles' house, which she is not on right now. She may be on later. And then, I don't know whose house that is. As I keep going up, we will get to the marketing little area where you can sit there in your little booths and sell your goods. You can sit in one of the booths, sell swords, anything really, like food, blacksmith stuff, armor just eggs and stuff like that and then we are moving up to the where all the districts combine or not really combine but the town hall and stuff as you can see quest house if we go look at the quest house I have not been in the quest house but this is going to be the first time I'm going in the quest house don't want to get hit by that zombie or just say only use the books to write your items and then place them in the hopper there's books and quills. There's a couple books in there already written. Let's see. Corrupt treasury. Um, corrupt treasury. Disease. Are they all done by the same person? Yeah, they're all done by the same person. So, welcome to the quest house. Come here to accept new quests. Please put, the, put back book once you read. Did, did I read that right? Please put book. Please put back book once you read. Yeah, I read that right. Current quest: corrupted treasury. So let's look at corrupted treasury. C uh, to make knowledge, there are six items, and these six items are needed to unlock a door. I ask you to go and re and search for these items. You will most likely need to join forced forced join forced with other players should be forces with other players you aren't the only one I've asked so to complete this quest more the more people the stronger and farther you'll search it your searches can go um, that's not what we needed though we needed to see what we needed for it, which I don't think I don't think these are the items though, because this is disease. Princess left. So now we are going to head over to the town hall in the main place. Um, here is somebody. I'm going to be heading to the town hall. The princess was back there. Creeper. The princess is right there. That's the princess. There's, I think, three princesses. One's a queen. Two of them are princesses. So here is the main part of it. Here is the town map, which 
still is messed up because it's split into three parts of the same part so to put out the fire over there this is the, the town hall which I will go in in a second lag a little bit lag this is just a free chest where you can go in and just see if anybody's left anything good like I will take those because I can brew potions with them and then we go into the town hall and then Town Hall is where you spawn and you can store stuff and you can look at the rules. This is where you first spawn. You spawn right there. You can use your ender chest for anything you need. Here is voting keys, donation crate, and then there's the rules and just some more rules. And as you go down, you'll get greeted with a sign as you go down the stairs. And then as we walk out, if we can actually walk out the door, we go over this way housing districts that way this way is or this is the info board I should say that announcements board new guild open near Gallandale memorial guild tavern has been res bleh. tavern has been repoed come on by repented I mean but as we go this way, here is the tavern. Actually, the one of the princesses' taverns, which there is a child in the tavern, which I don't know why. Please leave empty bottles there. There's some empty bottles. You can come up here, buy drinks, and then sit down. Just get whatever you want. Drink, you get drunk. And then as you walk out, you will be, here's the tax building, which I have to go on that right now because I have to look at what I have to pay for tax. I'm pretty sure it's just one gold block, which isn't too hard. Questions place here. Let's walk over here. Tax info, shop. All shops must have a tax chest in front of them. In front of the shop. Only Sunday, IRL, all store. Pay 10% of their store profit. Houses. All must have tax chests in front of them. On Sunday, all houses pay 3G in the game as tax. Um, housing info. For every five block addition to the plot is double the tax. The maximum amount for tax is 15 gold or 15 iron. Okay. And then, is there anything else here? I don't think there is. Government officers only. Government officials only. Okay, so. We go through here. King isn't on either anymore. There's just two different. The green is Stonovan and the red is some other kingdom. This is where you can enchant. You just walk up. On, I'm pretty sure this is where you enchant. Actually, never mind. This is not where you enchant. This is where people brew. Or, yeah, you can enchant, but... I'm going to show you the actual enchanting room. So, I guess you can walk over. There's a little bridge. I haven't really explored much over here. Somebody has glass bottles. But I am going to get out of here because I thought this was the enchanting place. And I don't want to be breaking any rules because I'm pretty sure I can come in here. I hope I can. Let me look at the sign. This is supposedly supposed to be a store. Stone. Yeah, that. Yeah, I can go in there. Okay. So, this is the enchanting room. As you walk in, you just go up the ladder. You can enchant whatever you want with lapis and stuff. You can make an anvil. And then as we go back out. These are just all little stores and stuff around here. Like right there, there is a sawmill. Just a normal sawmill. You can get sugar cane. So I'm not going to show much more of this. I am going to probably cut until I get... 
to where I want to go, which I don't know where I want to go. I may show you guys. Let's go check out the arena, actually. I haven't been to the arena. I know where it is. I just want to go check it out and show you guys. And then I'm probably going to end the video back at the house or end the video either dying or going back to the house because I have three hunger and it is on hard. So maybe I can show you what happens when you get banned when you die and get banned for a minute. I'm probably not going to waste your time doing that, but I want to go show you these, show you guys what's over here. And the next video, me and Average Drifter may go for getting into the military if the military guy is on. So, that'll be fun because we have to make a like application and go see how everything is. So, let's go look at the arena really quick. That's a cool arena. I'm pretty sure this is where you can duel somebody. Like, if you challenge somebody to a duel for, like, a reason, say they steal something from you and you accuse them of stealing it, you can challenge them to a duel. And if you win the fight, I don't know what happens, but if you lose the fight, you lose dignity. But, so that's the arena. I don't know what's up here. But, yeah, like I was saying, me and Average Drifter are going to see if we can find the military guy tomorrow and apply with a bio and application stuff like that and then we are going to if we get like approved with the application we are going to try out for the thing I think you have to do like a test course and something and you have to like fight somebody to become a guard because the guards sit here and pursuit the place and then guard like the princess the princesses the king all the people like that and they protect the town they patrol one guard got fired yesterday because she was drunk on the job I'm pretty sure I shouldn't really know that but I do so that was basically my review on the first the, its episode slash review so I will put average drifters link in the description sub like and comment. Have a great guy day guys. Peace.